Hello. Uh, today we're going to show how to get your Onshape 2D sketch into a Google Doc. So um, in order to turn this assignment in, you're going to have to put it into Canvas, and Canvas cannot read Onshape files. So you're going to have to put it into a format that we can, that we can can that's visible to me. Um, so let's take a look. So here's your sketch. Let's say here's an example sketch. This is what I want to turn in. Um, so what you can do is finish the sketch. So click on the green screen, the green button, and then kind of zoom in to the like to the level where you want to be zoomed in. Um, you can roll your mouse or hit the Z on your keyboard to do that. And then I'm going to take a screenshot. Uh, so I hit the. Um, I'm not sure exactly how to tell you on Chromebook. I think it's like Control Shift and then the button above six. It'll make your screen go gray. Um, and there's a tutorial on how to do a screenshot earlier in the module, so you can go look at that video if you need to. Um, and you can go there, kind of grab a screenshot, um, and it's going to save it to your clipboard. So you want it on your clipboard so you know where it is. Um, and then you can go over to your documents. All right, so I've got a, just a Google Doc here, and I can go to, I can go to Edit. And I can just say paste. If it's on my clipboard, it pastes it in. Or you may you may have like saved your your screenshot to your to your photos. So then you go to in it, you go to insert, you go to images, and you can find your photos, um, find your photos on your um, on your Chromebook. So it kind of depends on how what you're doing, but um, that's the idea. All right, so that's there there it is. And if you want to make this fancy, you know, you can go put some titles on here. If you want to like insert a table, you can say like insert, you can say table. I don't know, maybe do something like this. So there's like two. You can take this and control, like cut it out and then paste it into your table. So now it's actually like a little border. You could say my title here. And now something like that. You can center it up. You can highlight it. There's all sorts of formatting tricks. This kind of depends on like how clever you are with your formatting um you could say bye bye you know put your name in there uh, it's up to you uh, if you want to change the background here you can kind of go into file say page setup um, and then page colors and options so you could you know if you want to make it a nice nice blue color it does that and you'll notice my text here so this this cell here, this uh, table that I put in, I actually got to go and color that as well. So I get to change the color of that. Um, yeah, there's a bunch of things you can do. So that kind of becomes like uh, how clever you are with your, with your with your Google Gacken skills. But that's just the general idea. Let's see what you can do. Cool. See you guys.